Hello and welcome back to Polished Lifting. Today I'm doing something a little bit different. I decided to revisit ombre stamping since I only did it briefly, I believe last month, and that was the first time in probably years. I've been sitting on this like mountain outdoorsy theme plate from Cad's Nail Art for a while now. I probably purchased this over a year ago and was really just waiting for the inspiration to figure out what the heck I wanted to do with this one. I've seen some really pretty nail art with this plate and I couldn't quite decide how I wanted to use it and make it my own. I will occasionally copy other people's nail art just because it's so pretty, but most of the time I, I don't know, I just really like to create my own thing. So I decided to use purple and blue and then just blend it in the middle to create this kind of ombre look. And I went with a really soft uh, gray toned base from Glam Polish for this one. I don't have official swatches on this polish for you yet, but they are coming I believe Monday or Tuesday, just depending on how scheduling goes. For this look, I am using two press samples, one of which is the Beauty Big Bang Stamper that you've seen. It's really nice and squishy. This came as a set with the stamping mat that I reviewed a couple days ago, and it's perfect. I did do a quick dawn dish soap like cleaning of the stamper head and then I dried it with a paper towel but that's really all it needed to prep it for use. This one picks up really cleanly and seems to work with just about every polish I've used on it. The other item I'm using today is the Beauty Big Bang uh, nail protector item. It dries really fast which was kind of surprising and it's a thinner formula than I'm used to. I am going to be honest, I'm not entirely sure if this one is latex free or latex based. Um, they sent me a latex one and like previously and what ended up happening was it solidified in transit so I'm guessing it leaked a little bit and broke the seal. But this one was really amazing, there was no smell, no ammonia. Um, none of that weirdness, so I'm almost wondering if this is latex free. I will go hunt down this exact product and I'll link it in the description box below. But so far this has been my favorite nail barrier in a long time. I decided to throw in this little peely video shot, whatever you want to call it, just so you can see how it peels off um, each finger. You'll notice it does stick in a few places, and that's totally my fault. I ended up getting some of that barrier stuck to my actual mani, so it took a little more effort than what it normally would. Overall, I'm really happy with everything that I used in this video. I've always been a fan of CAD's plates. They're really well etched, they're easy to clean, easy to stamp with. Um, both Beauty Big Bang products were great to use. Um, I'm always in need of a good stamper. They do wear out after a while. So yeah, this is my CADS Mountain look and I really enjoyed this one. I hope you guys did too.